Okay, module four. So once I'm on Amazon.com, how do I rank for searches? How do I get people to find me? How do I get reviews and some listing strategies? Let's get it. So first, how do I rank on Amazon? First of all, reminder that Amazon is the third biggest search engine in the world. And essentially, how you rank when you're brand new on Amazon is essentially do a promotional launch which is giving away units for free or at a discount and following up with them personally and asking for feedback. Now, of course, there are different, many different strategies to do, uh, do launch promos. Pretty much any brand, company, or product, when they have a new product, they're doing some sort of promotional thing. And same thing when you launch a product on Amazon. One such blast service, uh, Viral Launch, actually provides. They have their own list of people who are interested in getting products for free or at a discount, and they plug you into that list and offer your product to their list. We have used this multiple times. There's also Facebook review groups, groups of people all around the uh, several several groups on Facebook where people like to review stuff so we've used those as well and one uh, side strategy of this is if you have your promotional customers all order your product on the same day that provides you a spike in ranking because Amazon's ranking algorithm is based on sales velocity first of all which is basically what is selling the quickest. Amazon wants to show essentially the best products that they think to customers who are searching for them. So search ranking also has to do with conversion rate, review quality, return rate, and other things that people may not even know about, AKA the data that Amazon has they try to, with their algorithm, come up with what they think is the best possible choice for the keyword that the customer is typing into the search bar. But obviously, long term, at the end of the day, if the customer loves their product, it's going to rank well because customers are going to leave good reviews, there's going to be less returns, and in Amazon's eyes, their data is going to put that favorably in the search results. And of course, when you're talking about ranking, specific smaller niche keywords are very important. For some big keywords, you may not be found, but for smaller ones, you may be on page one and that may be your bread and butter keyword. For example, the baby sun hat that broad keyword, baby sun hat, maybe you're not even on the first few pages, but let's say baby sun hat denim, stupid example, I made that off the top of my head right now, a denim baby sun hat, maybe you, are, you dominate that keyword and most people who search that buy you because you have that niche within a niche. And of course, as I'm always harping on, you should always be asking yourself, why would a shopper choose you? Picture your product on page one with a couple other dozen results and think, why would a shopper choose me and order me over all the other options on that page? Of course, there's much more on ranking. This is just, of course, brief, brief, quick overview. So listing strategies, here is this baby sun hat that happened to be promoted on Amazon's.com homepage today. So that's why it's my example. But of course, having professional and quality photos is important. Having your keywords and your snitch keywords in your title, your bullet points, and the description, which is below. Obviously, smart copy, smart. There are different, very many different strategies to on what to, what to type, the type of language that's speaking to your customer, basic sales and influence tactics that target your target customer and get them to hopefully buy it, convince them to buy it. 
if you trademark your brand, Amazon allows you to have enhanced brand content, which is basically extra photos down here, allowing more images. So that is one strategy that we do utilize. And also testing and optimizing PPC. This kind of has to go with ranking, but pay-per-click where you can bid on certain keywords. You basically pay Amazon a little bit extra, like every keyword is different price, but maybe a dollar, 50 cents, two dollars, and they will put you on top. So that is PPC. We always have this active and that's a whole nother university on PPC optimization, but that option is there. And the most sellers that are successful utilize that very heavily. All right, that's an overview of that. See you guys in module five, what it takes to succeed.